welcome to episode 110 of Out of Venga Shadow on FM24. I'm Jamie, coming up on today's episode, two games for you in the Premier League, both at home. In the first match, we'll be at home to Arsenal. I'll then play the fifth round FA Cup tie against Aston Villa off camera, and I'll show you the uh, home Premier League game against Luton Town in match number two. So let's get straight into it, and the team to face Arsenal is coming up in just a moment. Okay, here is the uh, team then to face Arsenal, and it is Garcia in goal, back for his Amas, Da Costa, Diara and Levine, Ronan and Benitez in midfield, Lucic, Stewart and Marcelinho behind Van Persie up front. So let's submit the team and go and give a team talk. <laughs> Okay, my assistant wants us to show everyone the recent praises justified and put on a real show. Um, go on then. That's gone down well, so let's get into the tunnel. Fate lies in your own hands. Can you win the Premier League? Managed to give ourselves a great platform. Um, it's Derby Day. How much do you look forward to taking on your rivals? I wouldn't call uh, Liverpool versus Arsenal a derby. Um... So I'm just going to say I've had one eye on the fixture for a while. Uh, elsewhere, Chelsea face Man City, hoping to keep their title hopes alive. Do you think they have a chance of winning the competition? They're contenders, certainly. So let's get out there and see if we can grab the win. And the first highlight is a free kick. Van Persie's ball in. And the header hits the outside of the post and goes out for a goal kick to Arsenal. Highlight comes to an end. Cajon now with a goal kick, which is flicked on. Levine wins the uh, second ball. Finds Marcelinho, who plays it back to Levine. Surely he's got to cross it from there. He's gone to the byline. He's got his cross in. And Lucic is there to head it home. But is he offside? Four minutes gone and VAR is already having to make its first decision and has disallowed the goal. It remains nil-nil. So let's um, encourage. We're doing okay. So let's hope we can uh, do better than okay. As Martinelli has a free kick for Arsenal and he's gone close but it's just over the top. And the highlight comes to an end. So uh, the first player to uh, begin to struggle is already showing. It's Levine. I'm hoping to get him through to half time. But I don't think I will necessarily. Amas down the left hand side. Plays it to Lucic. It's played back. And uh, Amas finds the Costa. Square ball picks out Diara. Runs forward, finds Ronan into Stewart. He looks out to the right, finds Levine, who goes past his man and is forced back to Marcelinho, who gets to the byline, digs out the cross, and Lucic has hit the back of the net. And it is Liverpool 1, Arsenal 0. We've played 22 minutes. And uh, we are in a great position now. So six points clear as it stands. Chelsea in second. But it's now an Arsenal corner. Martinelli's ball in. And Erico Silva finds the back of the net. 33 gone. It's Liverpool 1, Arsenal 1. So now we demand more. And I'm going to make changes at half time. Levine definitely will be one of the ones coming off, as will Lucic. So uh, there's the halftime whistle. 1-1 one, one at the break. Um, we can win it if we work hard. And let's go. Levine off. Alexandro on. Um, I'm going to take... Lucic off and bring Andrich on. And I'm also going to take 
James Stewart off as well and bring on Edgar Diaz. So three changes. Let's go. Demand more. And let's see if we can take the lead again. We've had loads more shots than Arsenal, but only one more on target. So we've been far too wasteful. But it is a Liverpool free kick. And it's Van Persie over it. Can he provide a good delivery that somebody can attack? He's eyeing up something. He's played a ball to the back post. And the header hits the outside of said back post and goes behind. Now I'm going to take Van Persie off and bring on Dolce. I am also going to take um, Marcelino off. And we'll bring on Cavalcanti. Amas finds Andrich. Digs out the cross. It's headed down. And Edgar Diaz smashes it into the back of the net. But is Dolce offside? 70 minutes gone. VAR with another decision to make. And they have again decided it is offside. So that change will now happen. We will again demand more. And uh, we have had more than double Arsenal shots, but we've both had two on target. And uh, Cajon has the ball. It's gone out for a goal kick, actually. And Thiago brings it forward for Arsenal, finds Hernandez, cuts inside. Hernandez shoots, and that's over the top. So one more demand more before the final whistle. And can we find a late, late winner? The answer is a resounding no. Benitez has picked up an injury and we've got no more subs left. So we are going to uh, bring our attacking midfielder back and uh, play him in central midfield. That's fine. And we'll leave it at that. So hopefully we can hold on. We have Liverpool 1, Arsenal 1. I'll play the FA Cup game off camera and I'll be back with the second match of the episode in just a moment. OK, well, following the uh, draw with Arsenal in the uh, opening match of today's episode, we beat Aston Villa quite comfortably in the FA Cup. Now it's time for a Premier League game against Luton Town. Team for that one, Garcia in goal, back for is Lucic, Diara, Van Zijtveld and Levine. Requena and Diaz in midfield. Amas, Stewart and Jan Cavalcanti behind Dolce up front. So let's submit the team and go and give a team talk. Okay, my assistant thinks if we carry our last performance into this match, we'll do well. We did play very well against Aston Villa off camera. So I'm going to um, point the finger and agree with him. And uh, let's get out into the tunnel. So with Chelsea having already played, is this a prime opportunity for your side to perhaps take a step ahead in the title race? Um... Well, we've got a two-point lead, so we've got the chance to make that five. Um, it allows us to know exactly where we stand. Um, we'd be nothing without our fans, and we have to carry that confidence into this match. And let's go and do that. So let's get straight into it. I'll need to put the uh, Premier League table back up. So there it is. And as you can see, we are currently three points clear. But we're hoping to make that five. As Martirosian is forced into a back pass to his keeper. Chiesa plays it to Aramburo. He's forced backwards to Vaz. Back to the goalkeeper again. And he plays a dangerous ball. And we've won it back. Cavalcanti finds uh, Dolce. And he shoots wide. Big chance not taken in the opening 10 minutes. Let's demand more. And we really should be beating Luton. So Cavalcanti's corner headed down. 
and Cavalcanti again. Diaz back to Lucic, finds Diara, back to Levine, out to the left for Lucic, plays it into Cavalcanti. His shot is brilliantly saved, but there will be a Liverpool corner which Lucic will take. So it will be a left footed in swinger, header away. Diara. And that ends up in the arms of Chiesa, the Luton keeper. Highlight comes to an end. Free kick is played out to the right for Levine. Who goes forward and finds Stewart. His cross deflects and hits the post. And Luton get it clear. Highlight comes to an end. So another demand more is needed. Soon as possible. We'll do it now. And so far, Luton have offered absolutely nothing. Cavalcanti's picked up an injury to add to our growing list already. I'm going to move James Stewart out to the wing. And we will bring um, Edgar Diaz forward. And I'll bring Ronan on. And we'll confirm those changes. And there we go. So half an hour in. Already got the first injury to go with the uh, two we picked up in the last match. Requena to Van Zeitveld. Levine to Requena. Back to Van Zeitveld. Levine to Requena again. Levine crosses it in. And that's offside. Dolce, even though he missed the target, was offside anyway. And our total domination continues. Lucic with a corner. It's a terrible corner. It's cleared. But Diaz does collect. Finds Levine. Clips it into Lucic. His cross. And Amas is offside. But now we've got a free kick. And it is Stewart over it. Clips it round the wall. And just wide. So it looks like we're going in at half time with the scores level. And that is indeed the case. Liverpool nil, Luton Town nil. So let's get in the dressing room. I'm going to thrash the arms. Nowhere near good enough, I'm afraid. And we're going to need to make another two changes. One of which will be James Stewart. And we'll bring... What can we do? Um, we can move. Um, let's play Andrich and move Edgar Diaz to the left hand. In fact, we'll move Ed Alexander Andrich to the left and we'll move Ronan to defensive midfield. Requena can move into the middle. And in fact, I'm just digging myself a deeper hole here. I'm going to start again completely. And we'll go right back to the beginning. And let's take James Stewart off. So I'm only going to make one change. And... We are going to play somebody on the right out of position. That's what we're going to do. So I'm going to put Alexandro out there. And I am also, in fact, I'll leave it at that for now. So two changes made. And two windows to go. So we're going to have to make a double at some point. Lucic pulls it back. It's cleared. Ronan to Amas. On to Lucic. He finds the back of the net. 47 minutes gone. It is Liverpool 1. Luton Town 0. So we've got the lead. And on the hour mark, we will make a double change. I'm not sure what it's going to be yet, but we are going to do it. So Marty Rossian finds Nazarenko. Into Wilson. 
Um, he's given it to Amas, but Aaron Burrow's taken it off Amas and played it forward. Diara's won it back. Amas turns, finds Ronan. It's played into Diaz. Dolce gives the ball away. And Umaguchi has it for Luton. Plays it back to Martirosian. Martirosian finds Vaz. Back to the goalkeeper, Chiesa, to Martirossian, to Vaz again. They're playing it around at the back and Amas nips in to win it. Pulls it back for Alexandro and it's a weak shot that ends up straight into Chiesa's arms. And Aaron Burrow with the loop and throw. Wilson to Nazarenko. Wilson's been brought down by Lucic. Olive, Michael Oliver has pointed to the penalty spot. So I'm going to demand more. The penalty's given. And who's taking it for Luton? It is Zivkovic. And Garcia not only saves it, but holds on to it as well. So just after the hour mark, we'll now make those two changes. And what have we got? Um, we can bring Alexander Andrich on for Lucic. And we need somebody to replace Requena. I'm not that comfortable with Benitez doing it for half an hour, but I probably don't have a lot of choice. Although that said, what we can do is put Van Zeitveld into uh, midfield. We can move Harry Amas back to left back. And that still leaves us with one more change to make. So we are going to take Requena off. And bring on the Costa. And let's get back out there. And start the match back up. So uh, picking it up is Van Zeitveld. Finds Levine. Plays it all the way back to Van Zeitveld. Levine again. Go forward this time. He does. Finds Alexandro. He's played it back to Van Zeitveld. Looks like we're uh, struggling to get out of our own half at the moment. Requena though to Diaz. And the shot from Dolce is high and wide. So disappointing. And now we've got one more sub remaining. And I think it's going to be Harry Amas. For Roberto Barros. So I'm going to do that. Even though there's still 20 minutes to go. I don't think I can afford not to. So we just have to hope. That we can hold on. To all 11 men on the pitch. Even though Diaz is absolutely shattered. I'm going to get ready. To drop back to cautious. And we'll do that now. There's only 4 minutes to go. In stoppage time. And there is the full-time whistle. Liverpool 1, Luton Town 0. I'll be back in a moment to show you the Premier League table and to tell you what's coming up on the next episode. OK, time now to show you the uh, Premier League table. And as you can see, with 27 games gone, we've got 19 wins, 4 draws and 4 defeats. 61 points. We're 4 points ahead of Newcastle. And we have a game in hand on them. We are a further point clear of Chelsea, but have played the same number of games. So we are definitely at least five points clear at the top of the league. So let's have a look now at when we're going to come back. And I definitely want to show you 
the Manchester City game but I'm not sure what the other game on the next episode is going to be because we've got so many cup games there are bound to be movements so it will be Manchester City plus one other on the next episode and if you've enjoyed that please leave a nice thumbs up on there for me subscribe to the channel for daily football manager videos thank you very much indeed for watching and goodbye <laughs>